Hi everyone, today is Wednesday, November 20th, 2019. It is 46 degrees Fahrenheit, 8 degrees Celsius, and the time is 4.49 p.m. I'm in Grand Central Terminal, and I'll be walking to the Lot New York Palace, which has a very nice decorated Christmas tree in its courtyard. So it's right now, it's rush hour on a Wednesday afternoon. Wednesday evening, so there's going to be a lot of people here. If you want to check out my narrated video of Grand Central Terminal, I'll go over this area in more detail. But this walk will be focused on going to the Lot New York Palace. There's also the uh, Grand Central Holiday Fair, which is just behind me in Vanderbilt Hall, only open until December 24th, Christmas Eve. Our mobile ticketing app, MTA Etix, is available now. So I'm now going up these escalators to the MetLife building, which is built directly behind Grand Central Terminal. Looks like there's some construction here. You need to keep left. Last year in the MetLife building, they also had a Christmas tree up. I wonder if the same is uh, happening this year. But the holidays are coming and I want to show you everybody, show everybody what it's like here. Still a little bit early because Thanksgiving hasn't passed yet. And I can see right here, there's no Christmas tree yet. But I would assume in about two weeks time, there will be one up here. Okay, it's back to the cold weather of the outside. What I'll do now is I'll walk west to Madison Avenue. Here's the Park Avenue Viaduct, allowing traffic to flow through to the north and southbound lanes of Park Avenue, past Grand Central Terminal. Okay, I might as well cross over here because I have the walk signal. I think I'll continue up Vanderbilt Avenue because there isn't a clear way for me to walk west yet. Here's uh, urban space. I'm not too familiar about that food, food hall, but it looks very nice inside. Okay, I can cross over here. 
So where I'm going to the Lot New York Palace, it's a luxury hotel located at 50th Street and Madison Avenue. So it's about five blocks away. It includes the landmark Villard houses and also a adjacent 55 story skyscraper. The hotel has um, been the set of many movies. I see that it's a set for Mr. Robot, Gossip Girl, uh, Cinderella on Broadway. No, wait, that's um, that was the set for a event, Cinderella on Broadway, annual holiday tree lighting with Miss America. And it was used for a Dutch children's show called Bassie and Adrian. So here's uh, Madison Avenue. I don't think I've walked one block ever since I got onto Vanderbilt Avenue without scaffolding. It's kind of like a continuous scaffolding where I'm walking. It's also non-stop bus noise one after the other. There's 47th Street. There's a sunset which is just about to go down and turn into the night. One can still yeah. enter Grand Central Terminal through this entrance. Some of the entrances are only open during certain times. Okay, am I gonna get a block without scaffolding? Let's see. Here's the M1 bus which travels along Madison Avenue to Harlem in Upper Manhattan. Okay, I just passed 48th Street, only two blocks left. Now there is a chance that this tree isn't up yet, but from past experience, I think it is up this early. But we'll have to see. The Rockefeller tree isn't even lit yet. It's um, lit on December 4th. But I guess you'll find out the same time as me is if this tree is lit or not, or if it's up.
So this is a good option to come to if you want to visit New York City, but Rockefeller Center seems too busy for you. There's a very nice Christmas tree one block over at the Lot New York Palace Hotel. And for reference, that's St. Patrick's Cathedral across the street. This is the back side of it. The front side is on 5th Avenue, only a block away. Alright, I guess I'll walk very carefully through here. I think we may be in luck. This tree may be up because I see some decorations already. But we'll see. Alright, we got some reefs up. Okay, folks. I knew this tree would be here. It looks grand and very, very nice. Beautiful tree. Beautiful star on the top. It's open to the public from 6 a.m. to 1.30 p.m. And nice decorations, bows and ribbons, just like they do every year. And this is what it looks like from the hotel entrance. I'm going to go inside and show you what it looks like inside because you can also find some trees here. Very nice. The hotel lobby is just as decorated as the outside. You can see here. Very, very nice luxury hotel. If you want your Instagram picture, but Rockefeller Center is too busy for you, come right here. It's one of my secrets of New York City during the holidays that many people don't know about. And here's from the top level looking down. All right, everyone. If you enjoy this video, be sure to subscribe, like this video down below, and comment on what was your favorite part. I'll catch you all next time. Take care.